in or for the first time. <laughs> you lovely ladies and handsome gents. I really appreciate you. Thanks for coming to see me. I'm Bold Reviews Lady and this is Talk to the Hand Reviews. Today I'm going back, back, back to the mini, mini, mini collection from my storage unit that I brought back um, when I went to my storage unit last year. Uh, I have 50 plus miniature vintage mini perfume bottles that I never opened back when I worked in, in cosmetics and fragrance. I never opened them. Most of them I never opened. I think maybe one of these I opened. But um, what I've been doing is I've been just doing like two or three every week or every, every couple weeks. Um, and I'm opening them now to let you know, do they still smell good or have they gone? Have they passed? You know, so today's fragrances are, ah, <laughs> don't want to drop one. Good old Shalimar. Now that one I did not open, but it must have evaporated or something. Um, they, I used to work for Galan in uh, promotions it in uh in the southern california area and we had these were gifts with purchase these little mini perfumes and it is a perfume a parfum and i think this might even be i think it's either a lilac or a lilac a, a lalik or a baccarat bottle i don't remember for sure but but uh yeah so shalomar maginoir from lancome and this one it leaked so i had to tape it up but I think that I did use this one I think back in the day so this one it unlike most of them it's it is not pure and then Issa Tees. you remember Issa Tees? oh boy I remember Issa Tees. it was a it was a big deal back in the day it's a it's like a really beautiful spicy floral so we're gonna open all of these one by one I'm gonna tell you do they still smell good I was originally gonna do Coco Chanel instead of Maginoir, Noir, and so I took the wrong notes. Um, so I'm not sure, when was Maginoir? Wait a minute, sorry, instead of Issa Um, Because I am gonna do an Issa Tease video. I still have a, a bottle of Issa Tease that I use periodically, but it's one of my, it's an old bottle, and there's only a little bit left, but I do wanna do a video on Issa Tease. So I thought I would save the mini, but I forgot. So <laughs> anyways, uh, so the first one I'm gonna open, is I think I think I will open Issa Tees first. I gotta find a a spot because I I've sprayed some other fragrances on before. You know how it is. They sometimes don't even wash off. They don't even wash off in the sink. Dang! I don't think I even have a spot. Issa Tees. This bottle is so cute. I should. Make sure that you see this bottle. Isn't that cute? I mean, these little bottles, they're just precious as can be. Teeny, little, teeny, tiny. Little, teeny, tiny baby. Mm. Okay. Oh, you got it. Okay. Not sure. I use Q-tips even though it's probably a better way. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's still, that's Issa Tees. Yeah, so this is probably a perfume. A parfum. Parfum. Yeah, that still smells great. And it still smells like Issa Tees, so I'd say that's a good one. Yeah, I'd say that's that's pretty well a 10 out of 10. Maybe it's a nine out of 10. Maybe it's not exactly the same, but I think it's pretty much the same. And uh, there's nothing on it to indicate if it is indeed a parfum or an eau de toilette or something else. So I think it is probably a parfum because why would you put anything less in that bottle? I mean, that's a stunner of a bottle. So yeah, Issa Tees, yay! Next up, my beloved old bottle of Little bottle Magie Noir. Looks pretty hard done by. <laughs> this one was definitely used. Do you remember Magie Noir? Did you ever use Magie Noir? Man, I did. I loved the heck out of Magie Noir. 
it's one of those really like seductive fragrances. It was one of those first seductive fragrances that I wore as a young woman. Okay, I did a good job taping this on. Okay, I got it off and I spilled some on myself. Not a surprise. It's the first time I've done that though with all these. And I think I also discovered it has lost its charm. Yeah, it's lost its charm. I don't think there's any more magic nights in there. Sorry. Well, it's probably an EDT, you know. A lot of the EDTs and, and uh, colognes don't last. So Magie Noir was a zero, unfortunately. But not to be confused with actual Magie Noir, which is a hundred. It's a fantastic fragrance. I. I, I love Magie Noir. It's one of those uh, headier fragrances that I actually like. Those, I don't like that many of them. So Magie Noir. And last, but certainly, certainly, absolutely, never, ever least. Unforgettable, incredible, Shalimar. Huh. I have to do a video on Shalimar too because it's another really special one, uh, both in fragrance, in the fragrance world and to me personally. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, did we not dance yet? Okay, so we're gonna open this little teensy Shalimar. Shalimar! I'm pretty sure it's going to open easily. We don't break it. Oh my gosh. No, okay. Here it comes. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's a really wide mouth. Here we go. Oh! Nope, no room on that side. Ah. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. Okay. Yes, it still smells great. So it's a parfum, I'm, I'm sure. I feel that that definitely must be a parfum. And it has really stood, it has stood the test of time. Oh, Jalmar. Oh, it's such a... It's such a, a sensual vanilla -y. Mm. It's, it's creamy smelling. It doesn't smell like lactonic. It just smells like, like something very smooth. <laughs> yeah, so. I'd see my Shalimar, I'd say though, it's probably about a nine out of 10. It's not exactly as fresh as fresh Shalimar, but it's still nice enough to, but it's still nice enough to wear. And yeah, but I don't think I'm gonna wear this one. I think I'll probably end up buying some more Shalimar, but I had so much Shalimar for free when I worked for Galan. I wore it a lot. like. Like most of the time I wore Shalimar, Shalimar and Samsara, because those were the two main ones that we sold uh, working for Galan. Um, yeah, so that's my story of my little minis, my dear lovely ladies and handsome gents. Please feel free to subscribe or give it a thumbs up if you liked it. 
give it a thumbs down if you did it. <laughs> no, no, I understand. Not everybody likes every everybody's content. So, anyways, thanks for coming to see me, and I hope to see you next time. We'll have another dance party. We'll have so much fun. Come back. Bye.